The Bar Skills competition features the best university bartenders from around the UK, all working against the clock to impress the judges. We've been doing quite a lot of practicing. Um, pretty nervous, <laughs> a bit shaky, but I'm excited. Um, yeah, I think I'm ready to go. I'm confident in my drinks, but the spectacle of it is a bit daunting. Just want to get up there really and just make sure I do a good job and represent the university. Competitors must prepare a sharing drink, a signature cocktail and a beer or cider cocktail. Expecting innovation, skill and entertainment are the increasingly less sober judges. What we really want is a cocktail that obviously looks great, smells great, tastes great, but also is made in a really sort of clean, hygienic way. I think how you make and present the drink is just as important as how the drink looks or tastes. Months of practice have all come down to this. There's also the head-to-head -head time challenge where competitors must make as many gin and tonics as they can in just one minute. I'm looking forward to seeing how um, messy it's all going to get because it's not, it's not going to be tidy, but it will be fun and it'll be great to watch. On your mark, get set, go! <laughs> so hard. <laughs> it was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be and it was a lot of pressure and everyone was whooping. Well it could have gone better. I mean obviously I had the hiccup with a cocktail shaker exploded over me. <laughs> but I came back quite well, I made a laugh about it and I smelled brilliantly for the rest of the competition. We've seen some fast paced pints and some colourful cocktails but it's time for the judges to pick a winner. Really impressed with the guys. I think the look of the cocktails the delivery to the judges, the customer service, has all been fantastic. Gold goes to Jack Wallace, Royal Holloway, University of London. I'm really happy. I'm really glad it's, yeah, it went well and all the work's paid off, so yeah.